The show winners will begin shortly now rather than the minutes countdown. Oh, it's on 11. It's 11. We should... Hold on. <laughs> hold on. Good point. Good point. Good point. Good point. It's starting, I think. Oh, two minutes. Two minutes. It's very loud. Yes. Get rape, please. Dude, I bet you it's gonna get really quiet. Oh, yeah, yeah. Once, it's once like worse when Paimon speaks. Oh, Karina! <laughs> Send link. You got it, boss. Link in the chat. Ooh. Where? In the Twitch chat. Oh. I'm trying to trick oh, people. Into... <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to trick people into watching me. Because that's the only way I get viewers, apparently. I told you, Zelia, it's so freaking loud! <laughs> I think that's just the intro, though. I bet you, too. Yeah, I bet you're right. Like, the intro is gonna be incredibly loud, and then, um, Zach Aguilar is gonna start talking, and he's gonna be silent AF. I hope. Now we can watch me watch the stream, watch through my stream on my stream. Now Nyavaruki gets to watch my stream through my stream, through my stream. So do I? Do I host? It is someone? very tempting to do that, Kit. I will admit, but right <laughs> now I've got the live stream full screen. <laughs> What's that, DQ? So do, who do I host for more streams? Um. I have six years right now, according to my Twitch Twitch um, add-on. Yabaruki has six years as well, so it's actually a tie. <laughs> They're probably all the same people. Here. <laughs> it's the know. same people on both servers. <laughs> <laughs> the six of us are literally in the Discord call right now. Yeah, <laughs> and then Shadow. We're all just watching each other's streams. <laughs> my my closed caption is in Easy German. Aguilar and I voice the male traveler Ether in Genshin Impact. You know, Windblade. And today I'm joined by no Korean today. Amazing voice artists. Oh, you're so nice. They are. Spike Knight Clee of the Knights of Pavonius reporting for duty. Want me to translate the Hi, German subtitles? Why? <laughs> Another layer of immersion. Really? Sure. Lee, <laughs> you know the consequences. Uh oh. And as for you, honorary knight. Uh, I can explain. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding, Zach. Hi, everyone. I'm Stephanie Sutherland, and I'm the voice of Jean, I'm acting quiet, grandmaster no. of the Knights of Favonius. Don't do Clee's forehead like too. that. That's right. What? And Laura? <laughs> oh, Did what? you see the picture? <laughs> Ta da! Barbara is here. Hi everybody, I'm Laura Stahl, and I voice Barbara, the deaconess of the Favonius Church. She also voices Sinya. <laughs> the idol singer but... of Mondstadt, I suppose. Is she gonna mention it? <laughs> oh, it looks like we've got an all Mondstadt crew today. No one's gonna yeah. mention it. And actually, this is the first time we've had four hosts together in one special program. Karina not oh, here. I'm What's so the point? Excited. We're gonna have a lot of fun. Absolutely. So, are you all ready for some version 1.6 previews? Yes, Yay! yes, sir. <laughs> and that's the spirit. I'm really excited to. Got too. that wrong. There's but us four as well. There, so in fact, let's take eight this hosts. moment to thank you. Oh. <laughs> for the support of the game. Wow. For sure. The value. It's been so exciting and sweet and lovely and wonderful. See if you watch this stream or Nyavaruki stream. <laughs> We get really a combination to know of four excellent hosts and four so other equally excellent hosts. Equally excellent. Equally excellent hosts. Yes, it has been incredible <laughs> to be a part of something so uh, amazing with such awesome fans. Thank you all so much for all your. Is, are they not going to mention that Laura Stahl totally also grateful. voices Sinya? Yeah, They're not going to mention. Totally it. agree with all that. Okay. So why don't we get the ball rolling with a quick overview Let's of what honest, players can expect no to one see in version 1.6? No one does. Yay, it's finally, really disappointing. Version 1. And now that Barbara has a sad emo voice, yep. no one cares about in Barbara version either. version 1.6 will have a brand yeah, new character. Whoa, so whoa, whoa no. Whoa, no. <laughs> and in addition to all these, we'll once again be seeing some progress so I, I in the game's I didn't count you, line. unfortunately. Finally, because you're not we'll on mic, so you can't host. We'll also be having some amazing updates added to our overall gaming experience with the version 1.6 update as well. <laughs> Sounds good. 
good to me. <laughs> As usual, I will host giving away redemption cards throughout the stream. And Copium. they might appear at any time during the show. Yeah. So I'm, I'm good vigilant. at making enemies. <laughs> Very good at making enemies. <laughs> yeah. Now, let's take a first look at the official trailer for Genshin Impact version 1.6. Trailer poke jump. Midsummer jump. Island Adventure. Trailer poke jump. <laughs> This is just this is just Ether's harem. This is Zach's harem. Lee harem, FBI. Mr. Jean, I want to ask for some time off. Let's be fair. The new events we had, um, Albedo's oh, harem. So I think Ether deserves one too. I still have a promise to keep to Klee. <sighs> Those fish won't blast themselves. I got a terrible, terrible letter and need to go to a certain place. Thought of going very important to me. I won't lose to Dodo King. Coming along to the rolling waves, it's so romantic. It has something of the unknown about it and seems to have its fair share of dangers. And yet, the mystery is all part of its beauty. Hmm, I need to bring Jumpy Dumpties, Dodo Go, and myself. Let's go! I'm actually so hyped for this, guys. <laughs> So yeah, bad area doesn't seem that big at all. Yeah, it doesn't seem very big. Oh, especially if there's gonna be a minigame involving boat riding. It's gonna be a much smaller area. I really like the jeans skin. Boba. Wicked okay. girl of flame. <laughs> you have finally arrived. Yeah, and I can't believe Genshin's getting a beach episode. You dare face me. Though such courage is admirable. I, I can. But it is now meaningless because... Yo, what the hell is that? Monka W. Oh, I like that he has- he's like on strings. You see that? He's like a puppet. Yep. That's cool. Oh, it's in the Please, abyss. Oh, oh, it falls. I'm not sure if that is a miss, by the way. Organizing the clash is my way of uncovering hidden talents. And we'll hopefully this later. time, getting a vision to glow again. Your opponent is new to the clash, but he has quickly become the dark horse of the tournament. The vision is missing. The sounds of nature turn into a clamor of noise during stormy weather. There he is, guys. There's my boy. He looks so cool, dude. He looks so cool. The birds come! color palette kind of suggests pyro though so i it's just no it's like I, um so it's like sure no i i like colors. i like the color palette Concept because it's like fall. Criteria i think that's the idea visions to living beings. i like the samurai stance the current electro archon now doubt these this flesh area or even the act in and of itself there will come a day when i too shall wish to understand the answers to eternity from her the voyage to inazuma is a treacherous one you will be plagued by a perpetual tempest the entire trip the part of your journey that lies after the storm may well prove to be the most arduous. Okay. So now we just have ads we can talk about, whatever. Um, the boat jumps? Oh, you can just leave the boat. Okay, that's fine. I thought the boat was gonna jump. How is a boat gonna jump? I don't know. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I bet. It's not my concern. I just wanted to jump. I see. Look, it's Pyro Traveler. <laughs> there it confirms. <laughs> no, just wait for it. Okay, no, I guess not. Oh, it's just a domain. Yeah, see? Really looking forward this is to a new... Tenor. This is a new domain with, like, more suffering. Yay, suffering. Ah, <laughs> I like the transition summer. screens. Tropical islands, surfing, all that good stuff. 
don't forget that we also have a new character to check out. <gasps> I mean, yeah, he looks super cool and he's got that neat Inazuma vibe. I don't know about you guys, but I cannot wait to know more about him. I like that he is a samurai that's on a pirate ship. That's it. Right away. That's my, that's my, that's where I'm at but on Kazuha. Before we introduce our brand new character, let's give away our first redemption code to I'll our viewers. So the codes are really just, just like gonna Zorro. happen out just like that? <laughs> Like He's like Zoro. Yes, correct. Good analysis. <laughs> Zoro is also cool. Okay, are you ready? Uh, the code True. will be dropping in three, two, one. Go, travelers, go! I'll copy paste this into Twitch. We're, we're still pretending that there's someone in the Twitch chat that's not in the voice chat right now. I already got the codes. Kick. Login. Oh. oh, my password's wrong. Oh, For anybody I that hasn't got the codes, they're in my Twitch chat now. This is. Oh, there's a space at the end. I like his canonical sword. It's the fillet. I like it. The fillet got yeah. I do like the fillet blade though. I like how it looks. I don't know. I mean, it's not bad, but it's not very special. True. Wherever in this world I roam, I carry memories of my home. This blade. It is the last link I have to the land of my birth. So our brand new playable character in version 1.6 is Kaedahara Kazuha. Ooh, oh, that Jean voice actor nailed that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> outfit is so flowy. I love the like maple Look at that. Yeah, right? <laughs> His style check. reminds me of a certain Fatui Harbinger, Scaramouche. Oh, yeah. You know, the one we saw in the Unreconciled Stars event? That's yeah. right. Yeah. The Inazuma outfit style is so awesome. And I like yeah. the way Kazuha speaks, too. It's so... Oh, will you do the Fandango? <laughs> I personally think his oh, he voices really Yuju cool. from Virtual Line. How he drew his mm. sword? Yeah, yeah so I know, cool. like, for real. So, so, okay, wait. So Kazuha will be the first playable character we've ever had from Inazuma, right? Mm. Yep, that's right. Whoa! Or wait, so does that mean we'll actually get to explore Inazuma with him? <gasps> Well, that would technically be pretty difficult to do. Although Kazuha If she's a main if he's a main DPS, we get really angry. He's been temporarily taken in by Beto's no, Crux not, fleet. Yeah. He's and there's even word from But if she if they make her a main, him a DPS, I'm going to be really grumpy. By the we need more supports. Oh, just don't tell anyone, okay? What? Yeah. Excuse me? Mm -hmm. This this baby face is a fugitive. Yep. This baby so face is a fugitive. <laughs> well, it's, it's hard to imagine. I just but well, <coughs> looking at his expression though, he does appear to be someone with an interesting Horny. story behind him. Horny. Yeah. Oh, I wonder what happened. <laughs> are we gonna blast we gonna blast um, Lee's <laughs> voice actor for Horny? Oh, on yeah. <laughs> That's probably why he laments over the memories of his home. I mean, it sounds like he really can't go back anymore. See, four equally oh, good hosts. We love you. Yeah. No matter the reason, though, Kazuha is a wanderer now. He travels around, taking in the views of well, the that mountains sounds very and rivers, horny. listening to the wind, and so he's kind of like a traveler, right? <laughs> Wait, he's a traveler too. This yeah, is, uh, and a very this is Zach's looking Harum. one. Yeah. It's the same one okay, CN too. CN had the same group. Kaza's background, but I want to know more Ether about skills confirmed. and talents. Ooh, yeah, sure thing. So, 
Kazuha carries an animo vision and wields a sword as his weapon. When Kazuha uses his elemental skill, Chihayaburu, he unleashes a secret technique that pulls objects and opponents towards his current position before launching the opponents within the area of effect, dealing animo damage and lifting Kazuha into the air on a rushing wind current. Amazing. Whoa, okay, <laughs> I like these animo characters. They can create those nifty wind currents and whoosh. Uh, well, wanna try Jean's wind current? Huh, um, no, but thank you. No, I'm good. <laughs> While Kazuha is in midair from the effects of Chihaya Buru, he can unleash a particularly powerful plunging attack. Wow. Midare wow. Ranzan. His plunging Whoa. attack damage like is converted that. to animo damage and will create a miniature wind tunnel that pulls nearby objects and opponents in. Shall confirm. So cool. Shall too. Mm -hmm. Another shall remake with special plunging attacks. <laughs> yeah. But just shall. Yeah, she just bought it. She's a soul chair. Budget shall. Kazuha's Yo. elemental skill can also be used in mid-air. And lastly, if you hold his elemental skill button longer, mm -hmm. it charges up to unleash greater animo damage over a larger AoE. Whoa! It looks mm -hmm. like Kazuha can stay floating in the wind for a while and decide when to plunge back down. Cool, huh? <laughs> that looks so fun! If I'm gonna have... So, <laughs> if you like run him the with the, um... <laughs> the four-star... With his talent, so craftable. swordsmanship, when his elemental skill comes into contact with any of the other elements, elemental absorption will occur, Irons thing? and Kazuha's yeah. plunging attack will deal yeah, additional damage of that elemental type option, by a certain percentage. Well, what I'm thinking is... You might have to wait in the air to make sure that both procs of damage activate separately. Kazuha slash. With a single slash, we'll see. Kazuha deals we'll see. AoE no. I'm gonna be really annoyed if you do. Passage will leave behind a field I'm gonna be really annoyed no matter what. Basically, conclusion, I'm gonna be really annoyed. But without C6, does plunge just in war of the Elemental enemy, absorption can occur in this field too. It's cool, but it's, it's I think so it's not worth it. With all the maple leaves floating around? Mm -hmm. Unless it does something Almost special. like Kazuha's confused his enemies with this dazzling display while taking them down with deadly attacks. <laughs> I love that! <laughs> oh, totally. Yeah, I mean, I'd be cool with dying in such a mesmerizing field if I were the enemy. <laughs> fair. I get that, I get that. I really well, like the maple leaf of aesthetic. Kazuha, Poetics of Fubutsu grants teammates an elemental damage bonus to their corresponding element upon triggering a swirl reaction. Okay, right. time to study up on how to trigger these swirl reactions. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You want to hear my advice? Mm -hmm. Ooh, yeah. Let the wind lead. Ah. <laughs> oh, I forgot to mention, mm -hmm. Kazuha also has an exploration talent called Cloud Strider, which decreases sprinting stamina consumption for his party members. Wait, that's actually oh, cool. Yeah. Great. So let's go travel with Kazuha, given the, that he is also a traveler. The dash, re, the, the <laughs> sprint um, reduction is actually No fun. more room for ether here. Oh, hey. <laughs> Delia, I'm do kidding, you want to I'm do kidding. ours now? Anyways, that's all <laughs> right about now. the new character, Kazuha. And I, I know everyone saw it as must well. be curious about the new event wishes. Oh, we watch it already. Only half a brain cell to do ours. In version 1.6, Klee will be reappearing other, other half in her brain own cell event wish first. Yes, yay, I'm back. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> Dude, After my server the just sensed the information in that the special program is about wish. to begin. Hype, hype, hype! <laughs> just now. Moreover, we so, yeah, have some for brand new weapons coming our way Ooh, in version 1.6. Ooh, exciting! Ooh, mm -hmm. The five-star sword Freedom Sworn mm -hmm. and the four-star bow Mitternox Waltz will be available in version 1.6. Okay, so Mitternox Waltz oh, is great name. official mm -hmm. weapon, Amazing but what's too. Freedom Sword? Seriously, right? Well, all right, this was all the latest we have on the new character and weapons. You're not going to tell me anything section, about the sword? We'll be getting some more info about it. That's pretty empty. Yeah. I didn't say I can tell you anything about the, Laura, the I'll weapons. Laura, I'll let you take the lead on that one. It's gone, so, honey. Okay. Yeah, it's probably on honey, but down, I'm still grumpy. Let the show begin. I'm going to be grumpy regardless. That's that's a stream. I really like the aesthetic of him having him being on streams. That's cool. Is he cryo? Whoa! Oh, wow. <laughs> I don't think he's specifically looks cryo. Like I think he can infuse with different elements. It, it looks like yeah. a samurai. 
Bingo! The core of Magu Kenki lies in its phantoms. When its HP drops below a certain amount, it'll enter the phantom stage. Oh. <laughs> During this stage, Magu Kenki's attacks will be converted to animo attacks. Oh, and animal? its phantoms will begin to appear and deliver coordinated attacks as well. Oh, so basically, we'll be fighting multiple enemies at the same time? Right! The phantom's attacks will be imbued with elemental energy, dealing both animo and cryo damage. So oh, animo and need cryo. To be careful of attacks from Magu Kenki, you must also dodge attacks from its phantoms. Oh boy, taking animo and cryo damage. Yuki, are you going to for free? Mm -hmm. What's up? Ooh, watch out for those You get a slow for free when he hits you with the cryo. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> Sounds cryo slow is so bad. Value. Yeah. <laughs> But it's always fun once you're finally able to take down the more difficult. Yuki, are you going to keep streaming after the stream zone? <laughs> yeah, of course yes, it is. Yes, I will. Okay. Hmm. I've, I've only recently oh, come God. online, so yeah, I will. <laughs> well, oh. take a look I thought you because mask. I thought you were working. It's more than just a decoration. In no, fact, finish work this now. Mask will it's like five o'clock here. Yeah. Any range attack. Five, five o'clock somewhere. Time to get a drink. Close combat. So, so, hey. After this live stream, I'm going downstairs and get myself a gym. There you go. There. Might find themselves disappointed. The true British pastime. Oh, I was just thinking about using an archer to attack it from a distance. <laughs> the quintessentially well, British girl, yeah. Looks yes. like you'll have to get up close and personal to defeat this one. Let's have a duel of honor, and may the sunset be our witness. Witness, witness. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah. Sounds like a line from a samurai movie or something. <laughs> but wait a minute, isn't this monster summoning phantoms to gang up and fight alongside it? I mean, where's the honor in that? Well, well, when you put it that way. <laughs> okay, let's just put that aside for right now. With the new monster comes new storylines. So let's move on to some exciting new info on an all new Archon, Archon quest, quest, shall Hold we? Up. <laughs> yes, let's please. Yeah. <laughs> okay, the new Archon quest is called Autumn Winds Scarlet Leaves. Ooh, Scarlet Leaves. Mm -hmm. Oh, I think I love the Inazuma loading to. logo mm -hmm. that they're showing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks I think so I know pretty. too. It does look oh, nice. Let's shout out the answer together, shall we? Sure. Um, okay. One, two, three. Kazuha! Hey, wait. <laughs> <laughs> well, nice guess. <laughs> <laughs> we love you, Zach. <laughs> mm -hmm. Zach gets bullied live livestream. But why does this new character play the front and center role in the upcoming Archon Quest? Well, don't you remember where he's from? Oh, right, Inazuma. Uh-huh, exactly. In a previous Archon Quest, Zhang Li told us that Inazuma was presently closed to the outside world, making it nearly impossible to get in. Yeah, we don't have much info it's a lot about of that lore. closed nation. We're gonna sit here and listen to lore. Things don't seem very peaceful right now. So, in order to make our way to Inazuma, we'll need somebody to tell us how to enter the nation first. Uh huh. Lore. And Kazuha might just be the person to help us. More we got lore. some screenshots from the storyline, along with some dialogue snippets. So let's take a look. Yay! Okay, cool. Just play. fly there, five. The just Crux take Clash the ball is a martial and fly arts there. tournament that I hold. It's gonna work. There'll be a Trust whole me. bunch of folks taking part Beto to showcase their talents. We're interested in getting to Inazuma, not fighting in some tournament. Inazuma, you Wait, why is the screen want frozen? to go there? It's no, he, it's literally yeah, a screenshot. Say, I, I love the fact it's a okay. screenshot. It's literally I mean, a screenshot, and then they put voiceover yeah. on top. <laughs> I am intrigued. Yeah, and well, do you think Beto would be up for helping? I don't know if she's Beto is Pog. To I'm Pog. Uh, she seems pretty invested. I'm now in her own immense Pog. Hold on, let me po let me pog for the camera. I too am invested okay. in this martial arts tournament. Now I'll put that on the <laughs> on the thumbnail. I want to know more. I'm but really disappointed that I'm not looking at your Zuma, stream right, right now. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know. Maybe this is just a big. This is a big. I, I didn't have time to tell. screenshot it. I don't know. I don't know. Just clip it. Just clip it. Just clip it. Just clip it. Just clip the stream right now. So okay. Cool. All right, well, and then and then and then you can the you can scrub to the yeah. right plot. Yeah. Yes, let's do it. My humble abilities are negligible compared to your incredible feats. To think a human could wield the elements without a vision, and not to mention your incredibly complex scent, like that of some mysterious being. Hey, stop evaluating us based Place on our skill. Why is always screenshot? <laughs> 
Sean has the best lines. Oh, Yuki, were you, are you He's simping now? He's got a good nose or something. I guess so. <laughs> Here's my question. I, I, think, yeah, I think we're, we're all simping. No let's, let's be honest. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I do see the chest in the background. That's the real pog. <laughs> OCD. Taiwan smells delicious. The end. And Kazo has a cutie. He oh is. Oh my gosh. I this is why they had they brought in three female characters, so or yeah, three female voice actors, so that way they can people. they can mm. sim for Kazuha without um know, without Aether know. having to stop them, <laughs> being able to stop them. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're we're heading in a weird direction. He's, he's <laughs> just Let's soft, get to our yeah. last screenshot. They should have put in uh, Lumian <laughs> instead of Aether today. But the voyage to Inazuma is a treacherous one. You will be plagued by a perpetual tempest the entire trip. One final word of warning. The part of your journey that lies after the storm may well prove to be the most arduous. Oh. Whoa. Intriguing. It seems like there might be some unpredictable dangers awaiting our journey to Inazuma. But I don't think it'll deter the travelers. <laughs> no yeah, way, it never does. does. Never. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. That sounded kind of scary. It doesn't this sound some... like smooth sailing to <laughs> me. <laughs> it's scary, I just saw the, um, also, like, the beautiful poetry. Pogo clip. Like so <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> I want to know if he's coming with us. That's all I want to yeah. know right now. Because yes. I want him to be my new best friend. <laughs> Did Laura Stahl legit just get <laughs> simping for Kazo? He'll save us all. <laughs> get out of the way, traveler. No, just kidding. What? <laughs> well, we're both travelers. We can all be friends. There's enough love to go around. I, I hope. Uh, <laughs> I guess. Hopefully so. Now, well, that's about all we've got for this new Archon quest. And in our next section, we'll unveil the exclusive events coming in version 1.6. Hunam, are you ready? This is your part. Yes, let's go. Event time. <laughs> uh, wait. Actually, we're going to give away our second cool. redemption code right <gasps> now. Surprise! Yes! <laughs> I, mean, I didn't expect that coming right now. <laughs> okay, everyone, get ready. The code will be bouncing your way in three, two, one. Ta -ta -da! Clee's normal voice compared to her, um, like Clee voice is very different. Obviously. It's very okay, impressive. How do you feel about that skin that Jean's got on screen? I really like Oba. the skin. Skin's great. Skin's good. Instant swipe. I just need to like have a jean, so no reason to buy it right now. I just just need a jean. Yeah. <laughs> this just is what I would put standard. on my jean if I had one. Exactly. Just just well and standard. <laughs> just well and standard. Yeah, yeah, I agree. I, I think disagree. we all tune in for that kit. <laughs> Let me. There's nothing that. It's literally buying viewers. <laughs> I like how they clearly are avoiding like straight up swimsuits. They're just like, we're just gonna have like a casual outfit. I like this better though. Welcome I agree. Back, Even though I'm a man of culture. Even though I'm a man of culture, I like this better. Let's talk okay. Because a uh, swimsuit is very generic and very <laughs> low effort to put. First, we That's have a fair. whole series of summer island themed events. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> These are going to be my favorite because Klee will no, be playing a super important role here. Oh, yay, Klee. Yoink. <laughs> I'm sure a lot of players are really excited for Klee's reappearance in version 1.6. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Get ready for explosions, travelers. Oh, oh, explosions. You know I'll be ready. <laughs> <laughs> The events are all hey, Kurt, outside Mondstadt, yes. so Don't we'll worry, be on. Uh, check this court. <laughs> Our main event is called Midsummer Island Adventure. <laughs> oh, that sounds good. Are we gonna make this, this an emote? Time, we'll be exploring a mysterious. Please. Group of <laughs> <laughs> the story begins as Klee receives a mysterious letter sent by Dodo King. Who threatens in the letter to take Todoko away from Klee? <gasps> oh no, that's so mean! Oh. I know, right? What? Okay, so we got a bullet. I know. How can anyone take Todoko away from Klee? In the book. Is the book good? It's a crime. But... 
So, in order uh, to I don't think it's Dodoko really good on anyone but Klee, but it looks really good. Dodoland it's just Klee's design. Yeah, yeah, it matches Klee's design really well. Obviously. So, who is Dodo King? And that whole Dodo Land thing just sounds kind of fishy. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm sure we'll get to know more about the letter and its sender once the events are live. I'm keen to get the furnishing blueprint. Yeah, anyways, I hope that I, the really vinyl player, when you click on it, when you interact with it, you can change the music so inside of your team. Yeah. So what the book does <laughs> is it gives a ton of attack percent this of substat, will be a whole and new area basically normal attack hits an opponent decreases your charged attack and the other way around. There'll be special That's pretty good. So that's good on a lot of the You could use it on Ning too, actually. And uh, Yonfei. Wait. Yeah. So we're actually going to be out there, like, sailing on the ocean? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's so cool! That's cool. <laughs> can I use this is, can we boat? Sail with our friends? Hmm? Can yes, I use this boat? Can. On um, <laughs> everywhere else. We'll be able to summon our own individual wave riders, and I think you can only summon it from certain mode. points that are going to be in, on this wow, island. So then I have a feeling okay. they're going to do like I'm a pylon, and as soon as you get a, a certain <laughs> way away, <laughs> it'll say, "Oh no, you can't go this far." Finally, and turn you back. <laughs> Just and let me use. I want to let me use it in the overworld <laughs> because it'll be so helpful. With the wave rider, yes, we can get it made things so much easier. Archipelago. Not only will we encounter some new material, but this is a boat hat has a stamina bar. Puzzles to unlock treasures it's like running, you know. The Ooh, that sounds mm. You can't, you can't boat for, you can't yes, like. It it's like a, you know, your your, your winds get really tired. Just taking the beautiful. Just I'm unmute scenery. yourself, Zelia. Don't be a uh, typing. Of it all. Weirdo. Oh, yeah, exactly. Zelia typing. <laughs> it's always a refreshing feeling to have something yes. new to explore. <laughs> he's uh -huh. smoging because he's alone. With all these islands. Curters. <laughs> People. <laughs> I'm gonna make this a twitchy mode, okay? We will have some brand new <laughs> quests to complete nice. along the way, but I'll be leaving those for the players to explore. Well, actually, ding, ding, oh, ding. No spoilers, my favorite song. <laughs> oh, okay, fine. <laughs> Anyways, throughout different stages, you have a rookie. Put this on your server also. Different kinds of events. Their own. Wait, they didn't show the. Yes. Yes. They didn't show the housing. Sounds good to me. Yeah. And there'll be plenty of rewards for travelers to exchange in the event shop. So. We've been talking too much. I haven't been listening at all to this. The challenge unlocked with the first stage of the event is called. Main cannon, make ready. Oh, <laughs> she's so cute. Okay, so it's been reported that monsters have been building some fortifications at sea. Travelers will be tasked with piloting their wave so riders and shooting cannons to send those pesky monsters to the bottom. Oh. Bang, bang, boom! <laughs> <laughs> some of these floating towers can simply be. I can only imagine how trash it'd be on mobile. Others cannot. In such cases, oh gosh, yeah. we'll I don't think I'd want to do this on mobile. The enemy towers for battle. Oh, okay, yes. okay. I definitely didn't expect to see naval warfare coming in an event. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> yeah, me neither. <laughs> for sure. Some of the fortifications even have Hi, Shadow. You didn't miss anything. So did you watch this? Find some other Whoa, Raid! Hey, Blue, yeah. what's going That's on? There may also be dangerous How's it going, Blue? Near some monster We're watching the uh, Genshin oh, Direct. <laughs> Players must be careful not to be swirled away. Though, it might be interesting to push other players' wave riders into the whirlpool. Oh, you tried Counter Side. Yes, How's Counter Side? I want to talk to you, Blue, but I'm watching the, the Genshin Direct. <laughs> A week in solitary <laughs> confinement. Hello, blue streamers. Oh, Hello, yeah, blue, blue viewers. <laughs> All right. The challenge in the next event stage will be Whirlpool off to starboard. Full speed ahead. <laughs> it seems to have a lot of events. It's a race, and it's comprised of two parts. The you wanted to watch the English one, too? All right, course. welcome. Wait, wait, wait. An air course? Mm -hmm. So we're going to glide, too? Yep, that's right. Oh. <laughs> So let me get this straight. Let the wind We're gonna lead. be out there both sailing and gliding. Blue, are you going to a whale for a jean skin? Exactly. Oh. Players will also need to do their best to collect wave splitter insignias throughout the race. 
both the amount of wave splitter insignias collected and the time spent to complete the race Imagine whaling. will determine the final <laughs> fair score. Point, fair point. So be sure to practice. But you got a. Oh, I will. You got a whale for genes, Jim. It's required. Our third type of event challenge you is need called. To, you need to beat the Samurai game over its head with your credit arm. card. It's on you. It's on That's way. that's all. Yeah. <laughs> Samurai. Uh, what happens if I want this game but I don't have genes? I, they should. They have to give you a gene. They, they should just put a, a give one that gives you a gene. But I don't know. I don't think they're gonna do that. Though. I don't think they're gonna do that. I guess it's certainly possible, but right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So. Like if they put that in there, like you get a gene, then maybe it's worth. That might be worth. It might not let you purchase it if you don't have a gene. That's possible too. That that sounds like what they would actually do. The goal well, of the be sort of limiting it as well because with monsters, the so with the event it's going to be cheaper. And That's true. Yeah. Encourage people to try and wish for a gene. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. I passed him by. I did. Blow him away. <laughs> <laughs> well, I thought this part of the map favorite. looked you can like throw um. Past and bombs everywhere. What? This part of the map looks that like the uh right. the bottom yeah, right of Leeway. Possibly turn her past look, the look, pirate well, traveler. I meant that it sounded a okay. bit unsafe, but that's a good uh, question too. Pirate traveler <laughs> confirmed. I've got my eyes on. Why are you saying confirmed as if it's something we're oh, not no, expecting no, 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 to happen no. anyway? We'll be blasting away some monsters. No civilian because property damage. Because that's literally him. Ah. It, this is his skill. It's an aim. It's don't an aim fireball. Three the, different kinds no, 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 of Don't look at the bottom right corner. Trust me. His hit pyro traveler leak. Fish along the way. Oh, I don't think. <laughs> well, these are the event challenges we can expect to see in the Midsummer Island Adventure. Insta breaking the ice shields feels good, man. <laughs> and mini Harpastum event. All right, good luck, Ayachi, being a good employee. That's debatable. Such as the four-star catalyst, Dodo Tail. Ta -ta. Uh -huh. <laughs> we'll be able to get this catalyst fully refined with its specialized refinement materials via the event, <laughs> just like in previous events. Officially oh, called yes. Dodo Tail. Totally I really like the name. Yeah. Big fan. I think so too, yes. It's cute. Travelers will also have a chance to exchange for the Northlander billet trove in the event shop. With this trove, we can select any billet of No, don't put the curse keyboard on the screen. So, for players who get stuck in the festering fang task because they're bad luck in getting a Northlander polearm billet, this could be their savior. Totally. Okay. And on top of that, oh no, it's floating over my screen. It's cursed. Blueprints available inside the event shop, so don't forget to check those out. Oh, okay, okay. I like the variety of rewards. Oh god, it's just floating around me. And Laura, it just so happens that our next event is about your character, Barbara. Oh, you don't say? See, see the picture of Jean and Barbara in their summer outfit. Yeah, they look so pretty and summery. I know, I love them. Look at her little ducky purse. I'm dying, I didn't. I love it. Okay. I didn't notice that she has a duck purse. Yeah, these cute summer outfits will be the first two alternate costumes available for characters in Genshin Impact. Oh wow! Master Jean's costume. Uh, Barbara's skin is pretty Deadline. cute, but every Randy is gonna rock it because it's free. The in -game shop <laughs> well, the other thing is, who runs Barbara? <laughs> And yeah, Barbara's costume, summertime She's allowed Barbara's to come out of the closet. <laughs> we'll be claimable for free for through time. our special event, Echoing Tales. Oh, if if they oh, give us like a Barbara like icon the summer costumes. for the That's summer so costume, cool. I can see that. Ooh. And it's so nice that we'll be able to claim one for free too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So tell us more about the Echoing Tales event. Sure. So during the event, there will be some magical echoing conches. Not only can we listen it to seems like we have a lot of events them, for this. But also we But can that's how it always feels like. It always feels like there's a million events and then we start playing it and then we're like, "Oh, it takes like 1 hour." <laughs> oh, the event screen looks so great. <laughs> yeah, it's like we are under the sea. But it always With kind of feels like they forget things blast. as well. Like they yeah. announce all of these things <laughs> and then it goes underwater. really, really quiet. And all of a sudden at the oh, end, I guess that's true. they throw in like tons of things for the us to do. Yes. Also takes yeah, that's true. It feels like called there's called highs and lows. Combat. In yeah. this event, we'll be confronting something called a Dodo Fortress. The Dodo Fortress will shoot Kaboom Balls of various kinds, and we need to use our Dodo Guard to reflect the Kaboom Balls and deal damage to the Fortress. Whoa, okay, so that almost sounds like a new kind of sport. Mm-hmm, yep. 
When we deal enough damage to the Dodo Fortress, it will enter a fury phase and shoot Kaboom Balls at a faster pace it's a while bit increasing ping -pong. the probability of special Kaboom Balls appearing. Uh-oh. <laughs> this one sounds like it might be pretty tough. Yeah. Aw, don't worry, Zack. The Dodo Fortress can be defeated. And after that, it refreshes, too. Huh? The more That's Dodo Fortresses we defeat you within get. a set amount of time, that name the cards. higher our score will be. The Dodo Fortress name Note card? that there will be different oh, yes. balls depending <laughs> on the stage. I uh, wish we could so PvP can this. Can we team up this with other fun. players for this event? Yep, but only two players at a time. You get co-op, but no uh, PvP. Hey, Stephanie, yeah, you have a rookie. Can you make better? a EN account yes, really quick? Please. Anytime. And speed yeah, run so that way we can have some content. Oh, hey, yeah. <laughs> I have got an NA account. Anyone ah, true. Let's anyone go. Uh, no? <laughs> Maybe you should I mean, just make an EU account. I was thinking about yeah, making an EU and an Asia account just so I could see, During like, challenge, friends. Players can pick up some Shazam fruit that grants Absolutely do it. Once we have successfully finished a challenge, we will gain... I really do like the name card. It's good. ...for rewards, including an exclusive event name card. How many new names do they include in it? A Shazam mm -hmm. fruit, and a Kaboom ball. These are all clean names. Those monsters in the event, never-ending battle. We have a really long live stream. Usually they're like forty minutes. So all we need but we're to still do going. is defeat them. Could it really be that straightforward? Hmm, sounds like Zach wants something to spice it up a bit. <laughs> oh, okay. flower beach That's skin, I'm scared. Spirit, Zach. For flower uh, yeah, beach I mean, skin. Huh. Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, there'll be tons of special conditions to add Skins to for the enemies. Ooh, first you can wail on. We'll get to choose the difficulty of our challenge, and of course... A can I wail on Fatui heart, uh, Fatui, Fatui skins? Yeah. <laughs> Can I make the Electra Fatui wear a Speedo? Circer opponents will emerge among the enemies and momentum. I think we should totally do that. Definitely <laughs> do that, especially the Hydro Gunners. I really want to see the Hydro Gunners. <laughs> yes. Fatui yes. And Speedos. And use her to destroy the momentum. The Hydro Gunner, the type of character who wants to wear a T-shirt at the beach. As momentum reaches specific yeah, amounts, so. <laughs> more buffs will be unlocked to help. At least it would be like a T-shirt and Speedos. That's fine. I just can't <laughs> <laughs> the challenges China censoring. are scattered all around the archipelago, <laughs> and each challenge has their own stage features and momentum blessing to consider. Ooh, looks like we'll need to pay attention to the different details for each stage. I disagree, Zach. We won't uh -huh. need to pay and, attention to and, the different and details and on each stage. we get to take a nice little cruise to the island sides along the way. Love that! Oh, okay. <laughs> it seems like all of these events will give us a chance to really explore the archipelago. Yeah, and there are so many different kinds of gameplay in the archipelago area. I'm already amazed. So cool! Yeah, me too. But aside from all the archipelago area events, we'll have an event that happens outside the area as well. Legend of the Vagabond Sword. <laughs> There's so many friggin' events. <laughs> can I get some more man. characters? Yeah, and what can we expect to see in this event? Trade offer. It's a domain challenge. In the event, three powerful <laughs> Because this players. event looks like suffering. We could kick up the difficulty It does look of our really challenge. hard. It looks like big suffering this way. Oh, it's just, it's, it's another, um, one of these events. Ooh. The ones where you make it hard. Name challenging the three I kind of want that name cup the image, too. And Oceanid, it's a good thing you get them all for free. And our <laughs> new monster. Hopefully I don't have to, you know, yes, score Magu too Kenki. high to be able to get the free name cards. <laughs> Let me okay, I'll sure carry you on right. NA. Magu Kenki? Uh-huh, that's right. I cannot carry you on EU. I cannot. I don't care about NA. I can carry you again. Oh, DQ can carry you. Yeah, DQ can carry you. Totally, I got you covered, Stephanie. Players will gain first-time completion rewards when they complete each challenge for the very first time. So even if you play Wait, one of this is Oceanid. Someone carry you? I can carry you on NA, Shadow. Besides. Each time you're combined, my credit card is big enough for three people. You can also play more. <laughs> my flying, so my flying credit try. card can fit three okay, people. Sounds good. Yeah, we'll do. And with that note, we shall move on to the latest optimizations and updates coming to our game. I believe you've got the scoop on this part, Zach. So I'll leave it to you. Make an oh, Asian account, DQ. <laughs> Zach, <laughs> no, no, I'm not playing the with free The first optimization thing. coming in 1.6 is about navigating to enemies via the Adventurer Handbook. After the version update, when players navigate and defeat an enemy using their Adventurer Handbook, the Handbook will then automatically track down the next enemy of the same type. 
Nice. Oh, finally. That's a handy little update for no, material. This optimization long enough. is just yeah, no, perfect. Yeah. The next optimization is regarding the PC version. Genshin Impact will be adding Finally. some additional hotkeys to its PC. Know all the locations anyway. With this update, Tell me something <laughs> useful. Yeah, by now we know them all. By pressing the O key and enter the party setup screen by pressing the L key. Oh, yeah, P and O. Okay. Help skip some tedious steps. That's good. That's good. Oh, definitely. Sounds awesome. We'll be able to switch out our party Wait members much faster then. Friends, okay. <laughs> Ooh, hot key for party setup. Like it. And that's I do all. like it. I just hope that I don't have to wait for the loading thing every time. Domain details to the domain entrance screens. This will provide a detailed list of the monsters and content <sighs> of the corresponding challenges. Oh, it's too late. I have them all memorized now. Unfamiliar with the domain. <laughs> this domain information. Yeah, it's always good to get some intel beforehand and prepare accordingly. Uh -huh. <laughs> By the way, when we teleport from a domain to another location, when you run double geo double animo, who cares about reactions and who's in there? You're gonna destroy everything anyway. Yeah, the screen I see all too often. Oh, yeah, I've done it by the time the Aside artifact, from all the these optimizations, probably... the Serena team will my, also be getting a new feature in version 1.6. <gasps> Get out! Yeah. First, I like... after the version update, we'll be able to invite up to eight characters at a time to our Rotate your gene. Yeah, look at this. The tutorial look at task, this. A teapot to call home, part two. Rotate While the gene. these characters reside in our realm, their character companionship they just stand around. gradually increase. What? That's so cool. Have her in his skin is magic. In your it is magic. Totally. <laughs> they need to be able to Not walk around. That, when our adeptal energy Please. rate increases, the rate at which character companionship experiences gained will also be increased. Ooh, nice. It is very comfortable. So your I guess the floor is made out of the floor. In the realm? We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> Each character will have their own favorite furnishing set. Oh. When players collect the whole set and place it in their realm, the corresponding character residing in the realm will give a gift to the player. We were literally seeing gameplay of it. Dialogues they can interact. Oh, no. <laughs> it's all the more reason to collect more. Oh wait, they give you stuff. Yeah. Bog. Yeah, it's so it's actually awesome bog. That the teapot is getting more and more features. The amount of bog, not that much, but it is bog. It's under continuous it's a minimal development. Bog. Small bog. Get more optimizations in the future. Little bog. Let's wait Little and see. bog. Okay. Now seems to be a good time to release our third. See, it's not a full pog champ. Redemption it's just a pog. Yeah. Great. Pog oh, can I do the countdown for our viewers? Yeah, sure. It's good. all you. Yes. Alrighty. Code inbound in three, two, one. Go Here. get them, everybody. Here's the next one. Anyone in the chat still hasn't used it? I haven't used it yet. I totally didn't notice a ducky purse. I'm surprised. That is an adorable purse. I wonder when that'll be available for um from you know to purchase direct from Mahoyo. Oh the the purse itself. That's true. That would be good merch. That would be very good merch. Also, I bet they're gonna sell the Barbara um costume after the event's done, huh? Oh, That's yeah. a good question good. whether or not they will. They might add it to the shop. Yeah. And with that, our version 1.6 special program has reached its end. We it? did it! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> so, how did you all like the special program? I echo where. 1.7 confirmed. <laughs> Fun. We got the inside scoop on so much cool stuff, like Kazuha and No, wait for it. And Barbara's new outfit. Yes. Is there an after clip? <laughs> so it's like uh, oh it's gosh, like yeah. the uh, it's like an Avengers movie. That's so poetic. And do we have to see? Uh, um, to see do we have to sit here and watch the entire? Uh, 1.6 can't wait. Yes. Never okay. enough. Yes. Never mm -hmm. enough. I will <laughs> So cool to get to see the new costumes. I'm particularly excited about jeans. Yay! And uh, so excited about the new character, Kazuha. And of course, Magu Kenki. Ooh. Magu Kenki. Aether has nothing to say. <laughs> oh, and Kaboom Ball. <laughs> Yay. Excited. I'm so excited. So yeah, awesome. me too. <laughs> and that's a wrap. But before we get to the end of the show, we'll get some exclusive details on Inazuma locations from the one and only Kamisato Ayaka. Ooh, no Ooh. Way. Ayaka confirm.
Welcome, esteemed travelers. It is an honor to be with you today. I am master of Inazuma Kamisato Art Tachijutsu, Kamisato Ayaka. Delighted to make your acquaintance. Perhaps you have already heard prior mention of Inazuma's current state of lockdown under the Sakoku Decree. Yet it's despite just like such restrictions and tumult, Why is it so word rent? of your feats and deeds across Mondstadt it's really and Lewis still rent. managed to reach the ears of the people of Inazuma. <laughs> I myself she has a very large which forehead. means such outstanding travelers as yourselves will choose to travel to our five of Inazuma. No, yeah, confirmed. Ayaka five Upon your arrival, perhaps we may meet at Komori Tea House. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yes, tea. exactly a twenty head. We indulge ourselves <laughs> in a game of Go, if you would be so inclined. Wow. <laughs> it goes without saying that your presence is greatly awaited here. Now then. Allow me to present you with a brief introduction of the islands of Inazuma before you make your official arrival. This is Watatsumi Island, an island draped in dense foliage and breathtaking colors. At the center of this island, surrounded by a canopy of mountains and waterfalls, is Sangonomiya Shrine. This island is some distance from Narukami Island, home of Inazuma City. In fact, Watatsumi Island is I didn't located that at the Ayaka far has a opposite mold. end of the islands of Inazuma. Given its distance, travelers will quickly notice the unique culture the and customs mold. among the residents of Watatsumi Island. help me Island. out here. They're bullying However, Ayaka. <laughs> what? Sangonomiya <laughs> is also I home to the channel. Resistance Army, which has formed in opposition of the Vision Hunt Decree. <sighs> Sometimes, I can't help but fear that we... <clears throat> Pardon me. I will surely present you with all the details once you have arrived at Inazuma. Next, we have Seirai Island. He yes, joined. back up arrived. It is said that this <laughs> island was once subject to a Leave terrible my disaster. Leave alone. The <laughs> island was enveloped by a perpetual exactly. thunderstorm. And then he left. The island's unique geography and landscape you see Mike now. Drop. And this is Surumi Island. I like how Atsu on his stream said this is what it looks like fog. when I had cheese. It has been many what? years since Just anyone has dared to venture picture. to this island. <laughs> Inazuma Pago. is home to many majestic sights oh. to see. Many of which are hidden away in more secluded locations. Take this huge tree growing among the mountains, for example. Though its trunk has been completely hollowed out, peculiar leaves shaped like bird feathers still you grow from its lofty now. branches. I wonder if and the day will come when we will hear Fazilia talk in my channel. Where the plants Please take a seemingly unnatural form. Does he have Almost a microphone? Almost stealing away some twisted thing. Yeah, he does, but he doesn't and talk. And finally, our last stop is Inazuma's Yo, largest yeah. shrine. The Fizilia, Grand Narukami join me for shrine. Oars. Yuki, do you want to do Oars as well? The Grand Narukami Shrine uh, sits atop Mount Yogo on Narukami so Island, overlooking lush and vibrant <laughs> blossoms of Thunder Sakura. Just as the Shogun's no, everlasting rain looks upon no, us. No, I didn't. So, yeah, travelers, don't want to join have me. any of the Fine, islands you'll not get my How Though about this that? was a most hasty introduction, <laughs> I, I like the shrine. You'll join be you, able then you can't join us for at your own leisure once you have arrived. <laughs> <sighs> if only there could be someone capable of turning the state of affairs in Inazuma. Good, oh, man. Uh, how improper of me. <clears throat> travelers, I shall be awaiting the day we can meet face to face in Inazuma City with great anticipation. I have the better Vutal art of artifacts. Whoa, so how did you like the sneak peek? That was phenomenal! Gorgeous, oh my gosh, I love it. <laughs> yeah. Speaking I the could confirm 1.7. is working hard to create an amazing fantasy world look for Inazuma. It's, 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 it's a lot of fun to sit if back and spend some time in the world anything like of the concept art, <laughs> it's gonna be beautiful. That, Absolutely. Thanks agree. for watching Where's the Genshin Impact though? version 1.6 special high school? program. <laughs> <laughs> so fun, How are we gonna have a high school bye, anime everybody. if we don't have a high school? Bye. 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 <laughs> See ya. It's not Japan if there's not a high school, man. <laughs>